Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Um, today's video, as you just saw in the clips beforehand, I'm going to be showing you what I eat in a day. That's about it, really. Um, so as you saw in the clips, I was making my daily breakfast. Um, this is what I normally eat every day. Um, for me, it's perfect. You'll see the calories. I'll probably leave a marker right up here, just so you get an idea. Um, and then at the end of the day, I'll add all of the meals up and put a calorie counter um, later on. Um, so yeah, you saw my weight beforehand. That was before I had anything, just the coffee. I need my coffee. Um, so yeah, hopefully you enjoy this kind of video. If you do, don't forget to subscribe. It really helps me out. And yeah, I'm gonna have this and I'll see you a bit later on. So. I'm back with meal number two of the day, um, which is lunchtime. It is currently 1.15 p.m. my time, so yeah, lunchtime for me. And we have left over from last night, pasta, green peppers and turkey. Um, again, I put the calories at the top there, more or less, because this one I wasn't able to measure exactly, but more or less I got it. Um, and a tub of cottage cheese love it um, so yeah I think it should put me now on around one and a half thousand calories more or less I think um, so yeah I'm gonna eat this and then I'll either see you in a bit for a snack because I know I have a snack in the afternoon or dinner time so yeah see you in a bit Okay, so it is my workout time now. Um, so you saw me, I had that smoothie. Um, so that was my snack, afternoon snack. Um, so now I'm gonna get into some mobility and stretching. Uh, it's Thursday for me. Um, so I've done Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday of weights. Thursdays or Fridays, I normally do some sort of stretching. So this week it's Thursday. Um, and then tomorrow again will be weights but I would highly recommend doing what I'm about to show I'm not going to show a lot of it um, because there's already I think quite a lot in this video but I'll show a few clips just so you can get an idea of what I do and yeah I'd highly recommend it because it helps out with any daily tasks that you're doing so yeah let's get into it Till I get up, time is barely on our side. I don't wanna waste what's left. There's 
storms we chase are leading us And love is all we'll ever trust Yeah, no, I don't wanna waste what's left And on and on we'll go Through the wastelands, through the highways Till my shadow turns to sun rays And on I've done 26 minutes so I'll just show a few clips if you do want to see a full video on mobility just let me know and I'll happily release that why why do mobility why stretch and I'm just going to give you three reasons very important reasons why not you should but you could be stretching or doing mobility so injury if you've ever been injured badly for example, me, I had a bad ankle when I was playing football and a bad knee also playing football. So I'd focus a lot on stretching that and strengthening my knee. Um, also, um, I play a lot of sports. Also, I play a lot of sports, well, especially paddle, which probably you might not know what that is. If you don't, just search it up. But basically it involves a lot of shoulder action and I hurt my shoulder badly. Um, you might have seen a few videos of me with it taped up. It was this right shoulder. So I focus on making sure I have full range of movement in this shoulder. So I move it around a lot, I stretch it a lot to make sure that that injury doesn't come back again. So that's one reason. Um, second reason is if you are playing sports for example, let's just say sports, whether it's football, tennis, paddle, hockey, wh whatever it may be, the more, the more flexible your muscles are, the less likely you are to get injured. And the last reason that I'm going to mention in this video, I'm not, I don't want to make it too long, <laughs> I don't want to talk for too long, um, is for just daily tasks whether it's putting the washing out, whether it's carrying the shopping, whatever it may be, walking the dog, whatever it may be, doing that extra 10 minutes of mobility every week will massively help. So those are just three reasons why you could be doing what I've just shown. 
So moving aside from that, back to what the video actually is, and that's me and my daily diet. So we've done breakfast, lunch, smoothie, which was our snack. Um, and I'll see you for dinner time, which I think we have a high calorie dinner. Um, well, it's going to be a high calorie dinner. So stay tuned for that. So we have the last meal of the day. We have pasta salad, brown rice, and three steak pies. So once again, I'll leave the calories at the top here and I will leave the total calories the whole day up there in one minute. Um, but yeah, we're gonna get into this and I'll see you in a bit. So as you can see, dinner is done, which means the video is also done because I normally, and I want tonight, um, I don't have anything else after my dinner, only a coffee, which doesn't really count as calories. So uh, yeah, I'm gonna leave the video here, but before that, the calories, we, well, I say we, I ate today were up here, should be around three and a half thousand, which is good. Um, so yeah, if you did enjoy this type of video, give it a like, um, and I'll see you in a couple of days with a brand new video.